What's up witches? My name is Taylor and I'm the Tempest Witch here on YouTube and today we're doing my very first unboxing. So exciting. So this is actually from one of my friend's shops. This is from Gilded Moon Arcana. I had ordered two things already from my friend Wen. And then we got to talking and she was like, hey, would you do a review of some of my new products and just kind of do an honest review, tell me how they are and help promote my business? And I'm like, absolutely, that sounds great. I'm always down to like promote any of my friends' businesses. So I'm just really excited. Side note, did I slice my hand open using my very sharp Marlin knife? No. Did I slice my hand, adjusting the height of the tripod? Yes. So that's how the beginning of this video is gone. So if it looks ugly, I apologize. I just don't want to bleed everywhere. So I haven't opened this yet. I just used my knife to open up the edges. I have not gotten into the box yet, which is very exciting. <laughs> So already, it's very pretty. This is the same sticker that's on the front of it um, that came in the shipping. It's got this cute little moon decal. Oh my gosh, adorable. I'm gonna put that on something for sure. paper to secure things. Beautiful, beautiful. We got rock candy. That's exciting. I'm gonna turn it this way. And then this is the one that I bought. This is Midnight Haze. This is a mugwort tea, or you can use it as an herbal smoke, depending on what you want. Mugwort tea is really relaxing. It helps with like, lucid dreams. And 10 out of 10, one of my absolute favorite herbs. Let's smell this. smells so good. It's kind of pepperminty. I'd have to look and see what's in this. And she adds brewing instructions. Delightful. We love that. It's got Damiana, roses, peppermint, butterfly, pea flower, skullcap, elderflower. Oh no, this one doesn't have mugwort in it. I thought it did. But still, it's got Damiana, which is again, one of my favorite herbs. So that's exciting. There we go. And these packages are very cute. And they've got the little moon decal that ties it all together. Ooh. Okay, so this is the Open Hand Spiritual Awakening Herbal Oil. Uh, when specializes in oils, she's the one who taught me how to use them in my craft. And I was like, oh, you sell these? This is so great. It's very like bright and sunshiny. It smells really clean though, not like soap, but energizing. Um, this is almond oil, grapeseed oil, mugwort, elderflower, meadowsweet, periwinkle, safflower, nope, saffron, birch bark, apple natural fragrance oil, rose, rose absolute, and vitamin E oil. So this is skin safe. You could definitely use this on your hands, your skin, probably your face if you wanted to. Got all the herbs in there. Oh, that's delightful. And then we've got Supernova. This is the Tenacity blend. It's a black tea that's got a bunch of stuff in it that just, ugh, very awakening, very bright. Like, I always need more sunshine and more energy. So I was very stoked. I picked out a couple of these going, hey, I'll pick any of these. Send me whatever you feel like. Ugh, it's dark, but fruity. This is black tea, mango, papaya, pineapple, blue cornflower, and fruit flavors. What do we got? Oh, and we got suckers and candies and things in this cute little star bag. That's adorable. Ah, yes, this is the Valor Energy uh, Power Oil. So this is, I wanted to use this alongside with the Open Hands Oil, just because it's energizing. It, it seems really redundant, but I'm a very, 
tired person. So anything to kind of help me come awake and do things it just sounds lovely. So this is almond oil, jojoba oil, grapeseed oil, lemon peel, frankincense, safflower, licorice, mint, peppermint oil, lemon oil, and vitamin E oil. So this would also be really nourishing for your skin. It's very citrusy. It's not like punch you in the face citrusy. It's very calm. And then this is the sweet mint sugar scrub. So this is uh, for your lips. I love mint. Um, if you aren't a fan of mint, this is very minty, but it's not like peppermint, it's sweet mint. Oh, then we got a wax melt. This is the sun god wax melt, maybe. I think a little bit of the sweet mint oil from the lip scrub got into this, so it's just a little bit everywhere so I can't really smell this through it. I'll put this in my wax lip warmer later just to see what it smells like. But none of the vials have actually opened so that's really exciting because a lot of times uh, the caps on these will break whenever you buy like potions and stuff. So, ooh, and this is the Lucidity High Concentration Dream Oil and this has Mugwort oil, sweet almond oil, evening primrose oil, rosehip oil, rose petals, skullcap, lavender, cornflower, frankincense, essential oils, and lemon essential oils. And they're just, they're so pretty to look at, and it's just, oh, oh, I love oil. Oh, okay, I know I keep having the same reaction, but like everything Wen makes is so good. She was taught most of her craft by her mother and her grandmother, so she's generational, and she teaches me so much about just herbalism, and uh, she has education in herbalism. I don't remember if she has a degree or if she just went to school for it. I can't remember, but most of her information and knowledge is from her family, which I just think is really special. It's flowery, but just a little bit citrusy, but it's also got dark notes to it. Lucidity makes a lot of sense for this one. This one's delightful. Is that? And that is just packaging. Okay. You know what that means. I need to play with things. I'm gonna try and do lots of productive things today. So having a little bit of just energy would be nice. Ooh. It feels really nice on the skin. It's not greasy, but it's moisturizing. This is the Valor Oil. And then all of these come in different sizes, so it's not just a, these are the only ones that are offered. I got, I think this is the smallest or the second smallest um, of the herbal teas that she makes. So you can get really big bags of them if you really love them. So definitely do that if you want to support her. And if you're looking to get into oils and you don't know anything about them, like me, uh, just look into these because she does so well. And I just want to share all of her stuff because everything she makes is so heartfelt and she's trying to get her shop off the ground and eventually she wants to have a physical shop in um, the area she's living in. So if we could just support her, show her a little bit of love, that would be delightful. Again, this is Gilded Moon Arcanum, um, which will be somewhere on the screen. But 10 out of 10 would recommend, and that's not just friend biases. She puts so much effort into all of her content. Uh, if you don't know um, anything about herbalism, Go check her out on TikTok. Uh, again, it's Gilded Moon Arcanum, or she's also of Bat Bones. Um, that's her personal account that she shares a whole bunch of herbalism. So just go check her out. She's delightful and we want to support her because she's great. I think that's everything. I'm going to go brew a cup of this tea and I'll be right back.
All right, guys, that's gonna do it for this video. Thank you so much for watching my first unboxing video. This was really exciting and I'm so stoked to be able to share my friend's talents with you guys. Wen is just an amazing person and if we could all just go support her Etsy shop, it would mean so much to not only me, but also to her to get her dreams up and running and supporting small businesses is something I really strive to do. So definitely go check her out on Etsy. Same thing, just Gilded and Arcanum. She makes really great stuff and supporting local people, supporting small businesses is just, well, a way to fight capitalism, but also to support some really awesome people. So go check her out, go show her some love and try the tea. Like if you're not into oils, you're not into scrubs, you're not into any, try the tea. 10 out of 10 would recommend this tea. But anyway, I hope you had a good one and I'll see you on the next one. Skull, my friends.